in our day in this uh, community today? How is everybody doing in this community today? CP has come again. How are you all doing? I hope you are doing good. I hope you are doing fine. You are doing great. I hope uh, the mercy and the favor of God is still sustaining you. My brothers and sisters, everybody in Grand Community on this channel, hang in there. Hang in there. The rain is about to fall. The rain will fall. Yeah, the cloud is heavy with thick rain. There is sign dotted everywhere. If you can read in between the lines, you should be able to, you know, to read the handwritten on the wall. If you are spiritually inclined about the move in this season, at this time and period, you should be able to read in between the lines. You should be able to read, to see the, enough to know that our season is here. The period of jubilation and celebration is here, whether the devil likes it or not. Ladies and gentlemen, as I have come with another good news again, that I'm going to share with us in this, um, uh, on this channel, let it go viral. Let it go viral to everyone that subscribed to Grant. Everybody should know about it in Grant community. Everybody in Grant community should know about this. Everybody needs to be here. Everybody needs to be on this channel. Share the link. Share the video links. Let's spread it everywhere in order to help people. People that need good news of hope. People that have been expecting this blessing to come. People that are, their hope has been dashed and trashed. People that are downtrodden, dejected and rejected. Uh, you know, they have lost hope or they have lost hope and um, they believe, they don't even believe there is grant again to be this boss. Let this one be a, a awakening video to them. Share it with them. Everybody that has lost hope or lose hope about this grant, about this blessing that we are expecting, let this video reach them so that they can come to this channel and stay here. This is the right, this is the channel of, you know, a good hope of, a update of good hope. This is a channel of hope reviving, hope re rejuvenizing. This is the channel that everyone that seems to have lost hope should be. So therefore, do them a whole lot of good. You'll be doing them a whole lot of good when you share this video with them or you tell them about this channel, CPNGO, let them come here. Everybody needs to be here because our celebration will not be completed or it will not be complete if um, all of us are not gathered here because the, the celebration of this blessing begins here in this channel and we need to be together, we need to celebrate together. All right? There is a viral, there is a, a, a viral VN or update that is going viral. Now I got the, I saw the, the, the update. I saw the audio yesterday. One of my people, one of my followers, I wouldn't know whether it's from this channel or in my group on WhatsApp. He took hold of the, he saw the VN and um, and he sent it to me. He said, "CP, hear this VN? No, are you sure we are still on the track?" Are you sure, CP? Are you sure that this grant, this money will still be disbursed? Are we on the right track? I wish we still expect it. When I listened to first, um, the first two minutes or three minutes that I listened to it, I felt I felt so bad. I I was like, where is this devil coming from? Is this one a, an agent of the devil that the evil evil spirits or bad people wanted to use to kill? people in grand community is this kind of a devil is he an agent of the devil that they are using that devil wants to use to demoralize people an agent of bad news carrier to make people feel depressed depressed and heartbroken and have heart attack what kind of a person is this where is this person coming from where is this person what is what is this person him an objective by saying this and i saying the vn is so much I would love to share a little bit of it in this channel, but like you know, this channel is a fountain of, of sweet water where, you know, messages and news that will revive, revive people and give them hope is coming from. And the fountain of sweet water or a source of a fountain of sweet water can never produce a bitter water, which is the reason why I would never like to share that good, I mean, to, to play the person's uh, VN on this channel. If not, I will love, I will love it that um, we should hear what the person wants to say or what the person was trying to say. It's a, it's a very rubbish VN that was just dispensing, talking bad about grant, that there is no grant, there is no this thing. So many things the person said. The person did not even mention his name. I mean, he mentioned the name. He said it's from a U, 
UAS uh, uh, committee, is a staff of UAS, and he refused to mention the office, the post, or his position in UAS. So how do we know the update is even true or is real? So that kind of a update cannot be, you know, cannot be taken seriously. It cannot be taken seriously at all because you just mentioned your name and then you refuse to mention your position, the post or your position in UAS, since you say you are a staff in UAS. So anybody can just come from blue, from anywhere, and give a VN in the, in, uh, on social media, you know, or in grand community, pretending to be who they are not. That is the way I see that VN. The VN is just a tool of the devil to demoralize people, scatter and chatter their hope. So, so that they can be depressed and have a high blood, pre high blood pressure or heart attack. And God forbid that nobody in grand community will have heart attack in Jesus' name. Nobody in, in grand community will have uh, uh, high, blood, high blood pressure that will lead to depression or that will lead, lead to heart attack. We will not lose anybody in grand community again till this blessing is given to us. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm using this time or this period to employ us or to advise us not to listen, to be careful the kind of a message we listen to. Let's be careful the kind of updates. This, this is the reason why I keep hammering on it that everybody that subscribes to one grant or the other in grant community in Nigeria should be on this channel if you really want to live long. If you want to live long and enjoy your, your peace of mind, this is the channel you should belong to. Try as much as possible to remain here till when our blessing is finally delivered into our hand, and whether the devil likes it or not, it will definitely, it will surely be delivered into our hand because we will not stop praying. We will not stop committing it to God. All the, the grand at last, we commit them to God's hand. The grand project of the blessing we are expecting, the disbursement will be committed into the hand of God. We will not, we will not stop. We will not rest. Neither do, do we cease in talking to God about it in prayer talking to God about it, telling God about the situation, committing the grand handlers into the hand of God, and the steps, every steps and every moves they are making in order to ensure this thing is being delivered and being given to us, we we'll we'll continue committing it to God's hand. Don't follow those demonic people that are spreading bad news in order to make, to, to make people have heart attack, to be depressed. I wonder whether you know, it's, it's give them joy to see people hang themselves or committing suicide. I think they delight, they take so much delight in seeing people depressed and um, at the end of the day, go and hang themselves, go and co commit suicide. God is not, is not, will not be glorified in such action. God is not glorified in such action. The name of the Lord will not be glorified. And that is not God's will and intention. For us, for anybody to perish. The Bible says God does not want anybody to perish. So it doesn't give God joy. God does not delight in that. So nobody should perish. But all should come to repentance and come to the full knowledge of the Lord Jesus Christ to take Lord and, as the Lord and Savior. Okay? The plan and intention of God is that everybody should survive. Everybody should be happy. Everybody should, uh, should, be, uh, should live a good life. That is, a good, that is God's plan and intention. And that is, all our, that is our aim. This channel is a fun thing that produces, I mean, it's a source of, you know, uh, a life-producing fun thing, a hope giver. That is what this channel is. And I keep employing us that any one of you that belongs to this channel as a subscriber, or any one of you that subscribed to one grant or the other, and you happen to find your way here, it was God that ordered your step here. Because this is where your hope will come alive. You have your hearts put together happy and rejoicing till when this blessing is given to us because this blessing is coming and it's going to be a deluge of of heavy rain it's going to be an heavy downpour of of rain that's going to saturate everywhere and bless every family and every home we will not lose our hearts we will not lose our peace of mind neither do we lose any of our family member in grand community nobody will be lost in grand community again till when this blessing is delivered to us and the time is here because we are long overdue for this blessing. I keep remembering every, everybody in Grand Community in my prayer, in my devotion to God. I commit everybody in Grand Community to God and that God should watch over our soul. And the Grand Handler, God should help them because they have good intention. You might not believe what I'm saying, but that's the truth. 
they have good intention as far as I am concerned, to the extent that I know, to the level I am close to them or to some of the people that are close to them. I might not be close to them directly, but at least I'm close to some of the people, some of the people that are close to who the people that are close to them. Okay, which you know they are giving me, they are doing the work of an intel, giving me the operation, how everything is going out there. And based on that information that I'm getting, I know that these people mean well, the grand that they mean well. It is Nigerian factor that is happening to this thing that makes makes it look as if they, they are evil or they don't have money to give or they don't have grants. But glory be to God in the highest that you know that Nigerian factor is finally taken care of because God is bigger than everybody. It's bigger than Nigeria government, it's bigger than any government of the world. So, and since you have, you know, we have invited God into the situation through our prayer, God here is not blocked that we not hear our cry or our prayer. And his hand is not shut him that he cannot deliver us that are crying to him every day concerning this, this grant. Because there is grants. First of all, I need to let you know that there is grants in this Nigeria. There is money that is called grant that is, is meant for the masses of this country or the citizens of this country to elevate them from poverty. But Satan has been has been fighting to turn to use people in the power, people in authority, to press it down so that people can be oppressed and pressed down so that their blessing will not get to their hand. But Satan has failed. He has lost the battle because God Almighty is involved in this matter. And today being the 27th of October uh, 2024, God will not fail us. God will not disappoint us. To you, or to most of us that are here on this channel, or in Grand Community in Nigeria in general, you might be feeling that, ah, as today is Sunday, as today is Sunday, the 27th of October, hey, will this thing still happen? I know that that is the trouble. That is what is going through, going on in the mind of every almost everybody now. I know you are counting days. You are counting days, and you are wondering if October will, will go without disbursement, just like the way September went and we are expecting disbursement in September, but it didn't come. Look at October now. Today is Sunday, the, 20, the 27th. With this month's end, without this, this grant being disbursed, just like the way September last month ended, my people, God is faithful. And if God is God, which I know He is, and is a loving Father, and is the one in control of the affairs of everybody in the world, he will not disappoint us. God will not fail us. He will hear, he has heard and answer our prayer, and he will surely make it happen for us that this money will be disbursed to us. In this month, even with the remaining days for this month to be to, to end, I know that there is nothing that is difficult for God to do. In the twinkling of an eye, in the twinkling of an eye, something will happen. God will intervene, and our heart desire will be granted. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, so shall it be. Okay? So, my people, I want to implore you that never you listen to that voice note. I know that most of you must have heard the voice notes I'm talking about. But don't give in to such a voice note. I will never share such a voice note here. Okay? So, I came up today to encourage us that you should not give in to such a voice note. And if you have listened to that voice note and it's, it has, you know, it's making, it has make you to feel depressed, if you have listened to that voice note and he has scattered and shattered your peace of mind, I'm using this period uh, by this time to encourage you that be encouraged. Don't let your hope be drafted or be shattered with that kind of demonic voice note. Please, find a place in your heart to put your heart together. Listen to my word and use this my word that I'm telling you now to, to build your courage again and come back alive so that you can remain alive to enjoy this blessing that is coming. I wouldn't want to lose you. Or anybody, please don't let such a bad and you know demonic voice note to destroy your peace of mind and make you have a heart attack. Please stop all the worries and stop any confusion that any voice note is bringing to you, because that won't it won't stop the good news. Whether they say bad things or the other, it will not stop the good news of this bossman that is about to happen any moment from now, and it shall surely happen. What these people don't know is that we have gone past we have gone past the level at which they are trying to attack the peace of mind of subscribers in grand community now. All right? They don't know that we have gone past that level. That one will not catch us. It can't, it can't, can't, it can't disturb our peace of mind again. Because what God is determined to do, God will definitely do it. And no power can stop God to do that which has determined to do. 
All right. So there is a particular good news that I'm about to share that I want to share with us. Probably in my next update, I will share this good news on in this channel. I'll share this good news. Okay. But I'm waiting for the meeting that's going to be held. That's going to be here today. I learned the meeting will be held yesterday, Saturday. Uh, but somehow, somehow, I didn't get to hear the outcome of the meeting again. So at the end of the day, I was told that it was postponed till today, Sunday. So I'm waiting for that, uh, that meeting. So the outcome of that meeting will determine the good news that, um, that I would like to share with us. So I want to hear the concluding part of that meeting, which we heard the good news that I want to share with us. Okay, so just hang in there and stay tuned. Stay tuned on this channel to wait for the good news that is coming our way any moment from now. I'm just waiting for the meeting that they want to do this evening to happen so that I can get to, to know, um, the, to have the full details about that, um, about that information because I wouldn't like to give us an unverified information or that is not complete. Okay, you know me for who I am on this channel, CP, that I will not give an unverified information. Okay, so let's wait. I want to wait for that meeting to, to hold today, Sunday, in the today's uh, this evening. So by then, I will be able to have the full details of the information that I want to bring to us concerning the good news that I want to share with us. So my people, be strong. Uh, hang in there. Don't give up on God. Don't give up on hope. And more importantly, don't give up on yourself. Because when you give up on yourself, that means your, your, your case has got into an helpless case. Giving up on yourself is the worst thing that can happen to anybody. Never you give, on, give up on yourself. No matter what you are going through, hang in there and be strong. And encourage yourself by yourself. By confessing good things to yourself that I will make it. I will not die before my blessing comes to me. I will live to enjoy the blessing of God that is about to happen. Continue encouraging yourself, you know, by, by this positive confession concerning yourself and concerning the grant and concerning your expectation. It will surely happen one day because any word that comes out of our mouth is a seed. Word of our mouth is powerful. It's not just ordinary the way most people think it is. That is why you need to choose your word. You need to be careful the kind of thing that's coming out of your mouth. Okay, because at the end of the day, it's a seed which will be sown into the ground and it will germinate and over time if you don't change it you continue confessing the same thing it will germinate and you you will live to invest it to invest what you reap i mean to reap what you sow so always be positive about it and shun every bad news concerning your expectation shun cultivate the habit of shunning and blocking your ears against any bad news concerning your expectation except if you know you are not expecting this disbursement but as long as you are expecting this disbursement, always shun everything that is contrary. Everything that is contrary or that is contradicting to your belief about your expectation. Okay? So this is the information I brought your way today. And I hope it meets you well. And I hope you have learned one or two things concerning it. So, and uh, utilize it and uh, stay alive. That is just the concluding part of the whole thing. Stay alive. And if you need one or two things that you need to do, I keep telling us, if you need, you need to be engaged. Because an idle hand is, is devil's uh, work, workshop, as, as they say. They say an idle hand or an idle mind is the devil's workshop. If you are not engaged, if you are idle, a lot of thoughts, a lot of bad thoughts will be coming to you. And as an idle person, once we hear any bad news, it will get to you so much that it will demoralize you. But if you are engaged, your mind is engaged, your, your hands are engaged, you are doing one or two things, you know, that is generating money for you, that is making you, you know, to make money to help yourself and your family meet your need and all that. You know, you have, you have enough strength and courage to stay till whenever this money is disbursed to us, whether it's going to be disbursed this month or even next year. But so far, you have something that you are doing that is making money for you to solve your problem. You know, it won't bother you so much which is the reason why I keep telling us at the end of my video that take advantage of food earners track and beyond the infinity. Those platforms, those two platforms, hmm, I have other business platform, okay? But those two platforms, I will not, I can't get tired of including them in my grant update. And why I'm involving it or I'm including it in my grant update is because I know that a lot of people are going through tough time, hard time in grant community, Okay? 
a lot of people are going through tough time in, in grand community. By the virtue of my status or my position in grand community, be an NGO and a philanthropist, I've been privileged, you know, to see people up for people to come to me and ask me for one thing or the other, telling me about their problem, what they are going through, seeking help from me. So with that, I'm able to know what people are going through because I live in this country, you know. Apart from the fact that I'm, a, I'm an NGO, I'm a huge subscriber to grants, whereby I spent millions to subscribe to grants myself. So I myself, I, you know, I'm in need because we are all living in this country and nobody will, that is living in this country will not, will not feed the heat. We not feed the heat of this economy made down, you know, that is happening now in this country. It's a tough time we are. We are living in a tough time. And it's only, it only takes the grace of God, you know, and the mercy of God for people to sustain in this country, in this kind of harsh economy. And the grace and the mercy of God that will sustain people, it is what will still bring a means, a means of sustenance, a means through which you'll be able to sustain yourself. God will bring it to you. Remember, God does not throw money on anybody, but he will give you, he will bring you into a platform where you will have a legit information about a business or an investment or something that you will do that, that will make you money to be able to sustain yourself and survive the situation. Are you getting it? So this is the reason why I keep on adding, talking about Beyond Infinity and Food and Astra, you know, in the midst of my grants disbursement update. So that people that need help, a lot of people have borrowed money. Some people, a lot of people are in debt. Some people cannot even pay their house rent or their children's school fees. Even ordinary food, three square meal, a lot of family and home cannot afford that. So people are going through tough time. And this is my passion. And it's, it's that thought that makes me to, to feel the passion of, you know, including, because if I just come here on this channel and I give us an update concerning the grants that we're expecting to give us hope so that we can stay alive to expect the blessing to come. That does not solve people's problem, you know? Yeah, it, does, it doesn't solve people's problem. So I would not, the information will not be, will not be complete. If after telling you about, about Grant, give you, if after giving you the update about Grant, I still didn't, you know, I still don't uh, give you an update about what you can do while you're expecting the Grant, what you can do to survive yourself, you know, while you're expecting the Grant. So in order to make the update complete, I have to include the aspects of the business that you can afford. Anybody can afford food and track because it's just 1,000 registration, okay? But beyond infinity, a lot of people, most people cannot afford it because it's, just, it's 50, $54. That is around 96,000 Naira. Are you getting it? But even if you can't afford that, what about food and track that is just 1,000 Naira? Can't you afford that too? Okay, so I need you to look into it and take good advantage of that because I believe that God has brought these two platforms in order to help us, you know, to be able to sustain this economy while we are waiting for the grant to be disbursed. And in any way, um, um, if you think these two uh, business platforms that I'm suggesting or that I'm telling you about does not really uh, suit your, your person, anyway, may, may it be known to you that even the grant you are expecting, Eh, the money you are expecting from the grant is not even as big as the one you will get in Food and Track. I hope you know that. Grant will not pay you 9.5 million that Food and Track will pay you when you get to stage four. These grants that we are expecting will not give you up to that. Grants will not give you 55 million that Food and Track will give you when you get to stage five. Although all this money I mentioned in Food and Track, it doesn't come cheaply or easily. You know, it's a network marketing uh, company. Not until you climb from stage one, you know, stage two, stage three, to do all those stages before you collect the money, all right? But if there is a, if there is a will, there is always a way. What it requires, what it requires of us to, to climb from stage one all the way to stage four and five, where you will collect 55 million, it's, it's simply strategies. And we have a strategy that works, that will help us to get there in the fastest, you know, period of time, and we collect the money which is the reason why I'm inviting you to join the group because it is in that group on WhatsApp that the strategies to deploy, that we are deploying, okay, is discussed. When you join the group, you will hear about the strategies we are deploying in order to help us to get to that stage five and collect the 55 million. And it's achievable. It's achievable 
within six months. So why not join us there? While you use you use that platform to help yourself, while we are waiting for the grant to be disbursed. Okay? So and I pray that God will help us. God will uh, we will survive the economy and God will intervene. You know, we intervene in this country matter, in this country situation, and um, it will help us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So I expect to see you in the group on WhatsApp where we can, you know, you, you will see the strategies on how to, to work with Food Earners Track. And uh, uh, Beyond Divinity is, a, is another good thing, another powerful platform, okay? You must have seen some of my videos that I did concerning Beyond Infinity. You will hear every week in Beyond Infinity. It's a very legitimate company, you know, very good, that God has been using to help me and people around me. Okay, since last year that I joined the Beyond Infinity, I've never regretted uh, that I joined. So I will see you in my next update, my next video, by the special grace of God. Nobody, none of us will be found wanting. None of us will be sick. None of us will, will die by the grace of God. So I will see you next time in my next video, probably tomorrow or there about to give you another powerful update. Um, till then, enjoy the rest of your week. Bye for now.